Welcome back, folks. Sorry for the wait. I'm over here in the forest walking my dog, Daisy. Say hi, Daisy. She's not very social. Um, well, I guess I could talk a little bit about her. I got Daisy maybe about five years ago. Probably, uh, I, yeah, I guess about five years ago now. Um, yeah, that one. Uh, very anxious dog. We got her fairly old. Probably about just a little smaller than she is now. Not Nothing too crazy. Uh, and then we got another dog named Olivia, maybe about a year and a half, two years after. Um, the dogs did not get along very well when they first got together. They were fighting a lot. Uh, probably about three bloodbaths of fights. You want to you wanna turn back, Daisy? Let's go this way. Come on. Never let your dogs walk you. Always walk your dogs. I grew up with cats, and cats... You gotta submit to cats a little bit. They're always gonna do whatever they want. But when you get dogs, especially because I got dogs later on in life, it taught me something about dominance and, you know, caretaking and a few things like that that some people that I live with just don't understand. Look at her, man. She's so happy. She never really goes into the forest, but she loves it. And every time she goes into my car, she whimpers like a little scared little girl. And it's a little bit sad. Um, yeah, my dog's a little traumatized, but I'm just trying to give her the best life that uh, she deserves. And I think that is what you should do to everybody. I think everybody should push everybody up in the best possible ways. But of course, not everyone's gonna do that all the time. <sighs> there's a devil on everyone's shoulder and there's an angel on everyone's shoulder. These devil and angels it is known as the id and the super ego. And then it is up to the ego to decide what of these are listened to. So, yeah, my, my id tells me, I just, because I, I work a little bit later today, my id's telling me, just Ryan, just lay down, maybe smoke some weed, chill out. But um, my super ego is telling me, Ryan, take this dog out to the park. Give her, give her a nice day that she gets to remember for a while. So, you know what my ego's going to do right now? Daisy, let's run. Come on. I'm also wearing slides right now, so it's not the easiest thing. But look here, man. What a girl. Daisy. Daisy. Daisy, come here. So, at this point in my life, I'm currently building an ISO booth for my room. Uh, that way I could start recording more in-depth podcasts. I'm making it all nice and cozy. I can record my voice with the kind of clarity and crispness that I think some people may consider that it deserves. Damn, Daisy, you want to go home already? I mean, I could record the rest of this in the car, but she doesn't really want to go into the car. I know as soon as I start driving, the whole mix of this video is going to be clouded by her poor little whimpering, but it's okay. I should have put a blanket in there, shouldn't I? <laughs> um, anyway, yeah, I'm, uh, just a short little update, just making an ISO booth. New content's coming. Oh, there she goes. Oh, just living life. Been kind of lonely, but hey, that's the kind of deal that you get. Sorry, you're gonna be looking at the palm of my hand for a few seconds as I figure out this recording situation. Now, last time I recorded an episode in the car, I forgot that I left the AC on. There we go. I forgot that I left the AC on, and uh, the whole video pretty much just got clouded by like like the sound of the AC right next to the mic, so yeah. <laughs>
she'll be all right, guys. Uh, maybe I can turn on the AC a little bit. Maybe I could use like a high pass and low pass filter. Excuse my uh, kind of messed up steering wheel covers. The car has been through a lot. It's just in today's day and age, it's hard to to find the resources necessary to buy new stuff. The economy sucks. That's why I got I got to keep creating even when I'm not working. So we can work our 50 hour, 60 hour a week jobs and then complain about our life not being the way we want it to and then go home and get drunk and get high and all that shit. Or you can shut the fuck up, you can get up, especially in the morning, the morning times when your brain is at its peak. That is when, oh poor Daisy. That's when you gotta do the most stuff. That's when you gotta spend time with your family, with my dog. I'm setting, I just got the acoustic phone panels for my ISO booth right now. So I'm gonna hopefully be recording some voiceovers, audiobooks, uh, stuff like that. Sending them out to companies and trying to make a side income like that as I continue uh, creating on YouTube. And Daisy's gonna be a little bit whimpery, but it's fine. This, there, there's, there might be a little bit of wind coming into the microphone, so let me stop that right now. I don't know if I'll be able to save the other video by using a high pass, by using a band pass filter to get out the, the AC, but it's fine. I will I need to do some uh, audio tech tutorials because uh, you, you really hear the world differently when you uh, when you learn about sound design and stuff like that. Like you can hear the tone, like for example, I could hear the tones in Daisy's whimpers right now and I could tell she doesn't like car rides very much. That's uh, that's what I'm gathering out of this. Poor little baby. Uh, might, might go to the gym today. You know, getting up my ass. I gotta, I gotta work two to six, nothing crazy. So making some money that way. Daisy, careful, sit. She, she doesn't understand the, the meaning of sit down when she's in the car. Daisy, sit! It's not gonna happen. She doesn't really understand human words too much. I don't think she's really a dog. I think she wants to be a human. You guys ever, you guys ever had an animal like that that seems like they're a human? It's weird. It teaches you a lot, though. Anyway. I just wanted to make a quick video for no apparent reason, just to put something out there. Just to let you guys know, more stuff is coming. Be consistent, be happy, be energized. Nobody asked for life. Nobody asked for this car ride. Nobody asked for a lot of things. Sure as hell nobody asked for this video. See you guys soon.